Welcome to today's video. We're doing gingerbread man nail art on acrylic nails. Hey nail tubers, what is up nailification squad? Hello if you're new or here for a visit. I'm glad you could make it. So as you can see the acrylic is already laid because today's video is really all about the nail art and I begin right away making the gingerbread man. I'm finally using the sculpture gel guys. I chose brown and although the label looks like yellow it's more of a cream like tone. So I mix the two to lighten the shade of the brown and yes you can mix these and it's so easy as you can see. Just work it together like clay it's just that simple. I even added a little more to cream color to get it lighter. Then I mount it on this dowel that's lined with aluminum foil. If you've been following my channel, you saw this technique in my M&M's video. Or if you'd like to see it, I'll have a link to it at the end. So I started with the X-Acto knife to cut out the general shape. The best way I can describe how to do this, it's like cutting out a shape close to a five point star with squared ends. Which is what I should have been doing when carving out the head, right? <laughs> I do appreciate that you can play with this sculpture gel as long as you need and get your art perfected because this is a product that needs to be cured. Then I begin to refine it with the silicone tool. So this is the sculpture gel you saw in my recent nail haul and I've had it for a while and I mean a good while. Hasn't it held up so well? It's so easy to work, like, like I just opened the packaging. Oh, and I decided to take out a chunk of a bite just to make him a little different. <laughs> Once I'm satisfied with how he looks, I cure him for 60 seconds in my 75 watt lamp. Then I begin doing the icing and his face. Look, he looks good enough to eat. And that's why we had to take that bite, right? <laughs> now, since these are XXL nails, I had to. I just couldn't help but do a not polish inspired design. And the flames that she always does be setting it off, don't they? So since gingerbread is baked in the oven, I put a sparkling flame on the pinky. Now he's even more worried. <laughs> And I'm struggling with this detail brush because I let it get bent. Well, actually, I didn't. I didn't know it had been caught in something and became bent. So you might notice that I'll switch to a slightly thicker brush for filling in. Do you like this so far? Have you done flame nail art? I sprinkled this with not polished sugar effect acrylic powder, then cured this for 60 seconds in my 75 watt lamp. And I am blown away at how this sparkle looks over this color. I use this same color which is by Madame Glam and I'll have everything in my description box. So I put caramel flavor drips on the index finger. And if you didn't know, I am super crazy over drip nail designs. Then I sprinkle it with the same glitter acrylic so it looks sugary too. So some of you know that I don't celebrate Christmas and this time of year can be difficult as a content creator when everything encompasses its observance. But you know what? I wasn't gonna be left out of the loop with the nail designs either. <laughs> I carefully chose what art to do and I'm happy with the ones that I've done and I hope you've been enjoying it too. If you have, hit the like button so I'll know and I hope you and your family are safe and well during this time. So yeah, Gingerbread Man is done with the twist guys and I decided to play even more into him being afraid of another bite so instead of... <laughs> Oh, 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 
I decided the nail should say, <laughs> Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. <laughs> I told y'all, y'all don't want me to sing. I finished this set with sparkling snowflakes and sprinkled them too and cured them for 60 seconds. And as you know, we are our own worst critics, aren't we? For some reason, I felt like I should have done something more. Like maybe there wasn't enough with the caramel color. But you know what? This was more of a how to do the nail art. And I think y'all get it. And I do like it. What do you think? Do you like my spin on Gingerbread Man? If you do and want to see more like it, I just did an icy blue penguin in a sweater set and a cute little snow globe. And you can see both by following this playlist link. Oh, and the link for the M&M nail set too. Remember to hit the like button and consider subscribing. But don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss what I'll be doing in the upcoming week. And I'll see you in the next one. Much love.